A 16 year old from Columbus is dead this evening after being hit by a car as she was getting on her school bus this morning. Now the man police say was driving the car is facing multiple felony charges. Fox 59's Lindsay Stone spoke with school officials who say there were multiple students on the bus when that accident happened. Lindsay. 16 year old Lily Strevel walked here to the bus stop early this morning. As she boarded her bus already filled with students, she was struck and killed by a hit and run driver. Tonight we're learning more about the charges he faces and how the community is remembering her young life. We hope you never have a day like this. And Today, Columbus East High School was mourning the loss of one of their own. 16 year old Lily Strevel was struck and killed while walking to her school bus. The bus was coming to a stop and stop arms out and uh, as, as the student began to cross the road, uh, another car came, came by. Superintendent Jim Roberts says counselors are working closely with those students who were on the bus and Lily's classmates as they process this devastating loss. In Lily's classes, we are making sure there is a counselor in each of those classes. Uh, as we try to address their needs and, and just get through this tough day. Lily was in the process of getting her driver's license and had recently bought a moped. Her passion was working with automobiles. She, her, her favorite class seemed to be auto tech and she had such an interest and passion in that auto tech class that she was looking to pursue that as, as potentially a career after graduation. 25 year old Sham Sunder, Shankara Soon Bramanian of Columbus is now facing multiple felony charges, including passing a stop school bus with arms extended. That we don't want to see. You know, we all have kids and um, kids that ride the school buses and things, and so it's just a uh, uh, you know, it, it hits close to home for all of us that have to investigate something like this. Indiana State Police is working with the Bartholomew County Sheriff's Office on the investigation and says this tragedy never should have happened. When you see those school buses, you know, expect them to stop, whether they have any lights flashing or not. You can see flowers here starting a memorial to honor Lily's life. School officials say it is so important to follow these safety reminders that this tragedy doesn't happen to another community. Reporting here in Columbus, Lindsay Stone, Fox 59 News.